1993 when I started here as a sales manager. Uh, we had around 26 staff back then, Solus obviously for Nissan and really the key there was to get this dealership 100% operational. Um, we were really working with a blank canvas so all the systems and processes we started from were really sort of testament to how we've expanded the company. Now, I worked with Glyn previously on the uh, former Nissan uh, network which was uh, AFG. So I started back in uh, 1989 as a trainee salesman working for Glynn, who was a dealer principal in the local area. And then when we came to start this dealership up here, Glynn invited me to come along to be uh, work for him as a sales manager. And then from years in progression after that, I went from uh, sales manager to general sales manager, then to uh, sales director, operations director, and then in 2003 to managing director right up to, to date. Our people really matter. An awful lot of our staff have been here in excess of 10 years, which is quite unusual for the motor trade. Me in particular, I've been here nearly 25 years, um, and Glyn's always shown loyalty to his staff. You work hard, uh, and you're rewarded well for that, that hard work. We're quite a, um, a sort of family-run business, I suppose people could say. I started when I was 18 years old, so I've been there with the company for 23 years. Um, I've seen the, grow, the company grow hugely in that time, and I've enjoyed every minute of it. Myself, I started at, uh, with Glyn back in 1993. I'd only known him previous to that, a previous uh, employment. Started off in the sales team, I worked up to become sales manager, various sites, went and opened different sites that we had. And then over the years, I've gradually got my way up to become brand manager, looking after a particular brand. And then uh, back in 2012, was um, invited to join the board and made, made a director of the company. <music> vastly experienced. The key things that keep people here, and I think the key thing that people should look at is progression. Um, we offer lots of progression, and we would rather promote people internally than actually go out and hire people with certain skill sets. A lot of that comes down to training, um, development, um, and actually on the job learning. What attracted me to Glyn Hopkin in, in the first place was when uh, I had an interview with Glyn and he laid out uh, his philosophy which was not to stand still. He always wanted to look for new opportunities and to work on the basis where we were in an area and then we would always look to go into the area next to it really by providing a high level of service. Uh, staff retention was one of his key things. Uh, and that's what attracted me to, to here, and, and that is exactly what, what's happened. He, he still has that vision today, uh, and we, we all follow that vision. Every one of our brands will want us to communicate with customers after they've had a, a service or a repair experience. But what we do is we use uh, an electronic iPad as a questionnaire, an, an exit questionnaire, and that, it's that kind of um, extra bit that we add that is the Glen Hopkins touch, but that will go through all our brands and all our sites. <music> First class. Professional. I think the thing that's made the company so successful is really a desire to be the best at what we do. We, once we got the template right at Romford and got things working exactly as we wanted to, we were able to quickly uh, replicate that across other Nissan businesses as we grew, grew and expanded. And then obviously the attraction comes from other brands to replicate that for their particular brand. And again, that's how we've expanded the diverse uh, portfolio that we've got across such a large geographical territory. 25 years seems to have flown past, um, but one thing we have certainly had the opportunity to do with the amount of staff that we've got, there's been lots of enjoyable experiences in parties and social events, sporting events that we've happened over the years with many uh, enjoyable moments to share. I can only say that um, working for Glyn Hopkin, don't look at it as a job, you have to look at it as a career. Look at where you can get to by looking at your peers because we started at the beginning, we ended up as directors, everybody else can do the same in my opinion. The message I'd give really for our customers is first of all thank you, uh, 25 years is a long while for the company to be celebrating in January for any privately owned company and really and sincerely we couldn't do it without customers wanting to buy our products and services. Um, the other thing is to say keep telling us, keep talking to us about things that you're happy with things that you'd like us to improve on because genuinely we will do everything we can to assist. I think if I had to sum up the group it would be really that we're a very very hard working professional company. We're always looking to improve, we challenge ourselves uh, outside of what anyone else would challenge us to be the best that we possibly can and as long as we've got that motivation I'm sure we'll continue for many many years to come.